After three Burnsville first responders were shot and killed last month, calls to the firefighters trauma helpline statewide increased 60 percent. That's from the Minnesota Firefighter Initiative, better known as MinFire. As Jay Coles explains, ever since the state funded the Hometown Heroes Assistance Program back in 2021, MinFire says 1,800 firefighters have reached out for help. In February, Burnsville first responders raced toward a nightmare. We have three officers shot. Police officers Matthew Ruge and Paul Elmstrand were killed after being hit by gunfire. Firefighter paramedic Adam Finseth also died trying to save their lives. You know, the only routine call is the one where you get there and you get back in one piece. His death heavy on the hearts of those who were there. I saw you run into the line of fire to save me and my guys. You're the bravest person I've ever known. I will be forever thankful. In St. Paul, four children died in a January fire. Firefighter Jake Ricks pulled three children from the home. I started searching, and that's when I found my first uh, victim. So I brought uh, her out. Answering more 911 calls like this every year, Minfire says the number of firefighters with trauma symptoms continues to go up. It's broken marriages, broken relationships with families, you know, Substance abuse issues, um, depression, sleeplessness, you know, all those things. Since 2021, the state has provided $4 million each year to help firefighters and their families get mental health they need. But that need is growing, and the biggest challenge is in greater Minnesota, where trauma therapy is harder to come by. And the bad days can really add up and are hard to let go of in your mind. Reeve says there's one big thing first responders and their families need to watch for when trauma's present, and that's isolation. And what are you willing and, and okay with talking about? Because too much isolation can lead into that depression, and then that leads to some bad coping me mechanisms. And Minfire says confidential help is always available at the number 888-784-6634 or on their website, minfireinitiative.com, and there's an app for peer support. All of this can be found on our website, kstp.com, when you link to the story. Jay Coles, 5 Eyewitness News. Jay, they're doing a lot of good. Thank you.